Good morning. Today we are going to discuss how we can create volume on dynamic disk. So let's start with what are the various types of uh, volumes we can create on a dynamic disk. So as you must be aware, there are five general types of uh, volumes we use to create on a dynamic disk. First one is simple volume, uh, then span volume. Striped volume, mirror volume, and red file. Striped volume is rate 0 and mirror is rate 1. Okay. And let's have a quick look on the requirements. For simple volume, you need to have only one dynamic disk, that is one hard disk drive. It must be dynamic. It, and all these three span, stripe, and mirror, all these three requires minimum of two hard drives. And all must be dynamic. And rate 5 requires minimum of three hard disk drive. And all must be dynamic. So, Let's start for you can go to uh, uh, computer management. Just right click on my computer, click on manage, it will open the computer management, and then click on disk management. Okay, so first, what you need to do by default, your hard disk drive is a basic disk. First, you need to convert it to dynamic disk. So just right click on the disk. Here you can see there are two hard disk drives installed in this PC. This is disk 0 and disk 1. Just right click on uh, any one of them and it will show you option convert to dynamic disk. Just right, uh, just click here. It will show you a list of all these hard disk drives present in your PC. Just check all the drives, select all the drives and click here to convert the drive. It will restart your PC. Once it is restarted, it will show you something like this. Okay. This is nothing but your simple volume. This is your primary partitions. Or previous partitions created on basic sticks will be simply converted to simple volume. So uh, now start with uh, what are the volumes and how we can create it. Uh, these are simple volumes and these are analytical space that will be used to create uh, uh, other volumes. Okay. So to uh, start creating any volume, just right click on unallocated space and right click uh, on uh, unallocated space and it will show you this option just click on new volume instead of partition it is showing volume okay this will open this wizard this wizard will help you to uh, create different types of volumes and you can format the volumes as well okay just click on next here you can see there are three options given one is simple volume, span volume, and striped volume. Why three only? Because right now we are using Windows XP operating system. And Windows XP operating system supports only these types of volume. So we will have a look on these three on, uh, the volumes only. Okay. So you can see here there are five types of volume. Simple, span, striped, mirrored, and red file. To uh, have a look on mirrored and red file, we will have a separate video on it. And uh, we need to have window, uh, Windows 2000 server or higher version of operating system. So what are simple volume? It is uh, given here. Simple volume is made up of free space on a single dynamic disk. Okay. What is the key feature? You can extend a simple volume by adding free space from same disk or another disk. Let's have a look at span volume. A span volume is made up of disk space on more than one dynamic. That is two or three or more than that okay uh, create as a span volume if you need a volume that is too large for a single disk well, if you want to create large volume by adding space from two or three hard drives you can use this option what is the key feature it can be extended okay using same space from same hard drive or other hard drive let's have a look on stripe volume stripe volume stores data in stripes okay on two or more dynamic disks, a striped volume gives you faster access to the data than simple and span volume. So, uh, if you want faster access to your data, you prefer to use striped volume. But what is the limitation? You cannot extend striped volume. Let's start with how to create. Just click on simple volume, it will, and then click next. It will show you this type of option. Simple volume can be created using only one disk. You can add any one disk at a time only, either zero or just I have selected this zero and you can specify the space you want to allocate for the partition or for the volume. Just specify the space. This is the total available space. Uh, I have given 2000. So 2000 megabyte will be allocated for this volume. 
just click on next it will ask you to assign drive editor by default it assigns a bla available blank with the unused uh, drive editor if you want you can change from this drop down menu okay just click on next uh, it will show you uh, format options which file system you want to use the preferred file system is ntfs so select by default it is selected uh, you can assign the volume level by default it is new volume you can assign the mother name this is the allocation unit size that is you can choose the cluster size here you can leave it to default now you can uh, tick here perform quick format this will uh, format the drive quickly okay just click on next here you can see summary of uh, what you have selected volume type is simple this selected is zero volume size is 2000 mb drive letter it is file system is allocation unit is default volume level new level new volume quick format yes just click finish once uh, you will finish the process you will see that this drive will be formatted and it will be ready for use in few seconds now you can see when you right click on these uh, simple volumes you can see these options the key thing is that you can extend volumes let's have a look how you can extend this volume so there are two possible options you can uh, choose either disk zero or you can choose disk one let's start with disk zero this zero is the same uh, disk on which right now the part, uh, volume exists just click on next you can see that a single drive letter is assigned no new drive is created it is still in this and you can see the capacity earlier we have defined uh, a volume d with storage capacity 2000 mb here we have added 1000 more so you can see it's now almost 3 gb of space so this is a single one single drive letter here you can these are physically separated but it is having a single drive letter. This is how you can extend. Let's have a look on if how you can extend it using space from other drive, other hard disk drive. Just click on right click uh, on the drive and it will show you extend volume option. Just click on extend one and this wizard will open. Here, what we are doing instead of selecting zero, we are selecting one and we have given assigned 50, 100, uh, 1500 mb of space. So, see this one shift space is available in this one just click next you can see uh, this is still is a d drive d drive in d drive and its space is now 4.39 gb but you can observe that its color is changed so you must be aware a simple volume is a volume that is created using free space on a single hard disk drive okay so as you have extended it using space from a second hard disk drive it is no more a simple volume it will be converted to spanned volume that's why its color is changed you can uh, see here the legion black is unallocated this one is simple volume and this is spanned volume so once you extend a simple volume using just a space from other hard disk drive it will be converted to spanned volume let's now come on to how to create span volume just check the right click on unallocated space and click on new volume it will open the wizard just check span volume and click next here you can add disk both disk uh, by clicking add button okay you can add zero and one just uh, add the price say i have added zero then it will ask you to add still see you can see uh, this next button is disabled because you need to specify two disks and we have a specified only one uh, disk only so it will be enabled only if you have added two hard disk drives say i have added two hard drives and i have picked uh, 1200 mb from the disk 0 and 1500 mb from disk 1 now see next is enable just click on next so total size will be 2700 mb it will assign a drive letter f and uh, just click next uh, this is about uh, the file system 
you have already a lot of these options just check uh, quick format click next this is the summary span volume space from this zero and this one total space this one all the information you are already aware of just click finish you can see a new drive f is created this is the drive space from this disk and this disk. how much the size it is almost we have assigned 2700 gmb of space that is equivalent to 2.64 gb this is how you can create a span volume and last that is striped volume striped volume just right click on uh, Unallocated space, click on new volume, it will show you this option, select stripe volume and uh, you can add space, still you can see uh, next is disabled, you have to add both the disk and the key thing about this is right now it is showing you the entire space available in this uh, 0 that is 18,368 uh, add this one and you if you change the size to say 1200 both will be changed to 1200 the key thing about a striped volume is that it uses same space this is space from both the artist stripe whatever you pick say you are picking 2000 so it will pick up space 2000 mb of space from this zero and this one both okay this is the key difference pan and stripe volume okay next uh, it will ask you to assign driver by default G is assigned. Uh, uh, in the summary part format options in, uh, also asked uh, that you are already aware of. Here you can see the volume size is 2400 MB and uh, uh, this is the trial letter and file system. Just click on finish. You can see uh, this is uh, your stripe volume. So this is the disk space that is 2.34 GB. You can uh, extend span volume, but uh, we cannot extend stripe volume. Here you can see uh, when you right click on the stripe volume, it is not showing you uh, extend volume option. So it verifies that this cannot be extended. That's all for now. Thank you.